Chicago, where the city's police chief has been fired by the mayor just weeks before his retirement. The mayor citing ethical lapses that she said were, quote, intolerable. The mayor saying the police chief lied to her repeatedly after he was found asleep parked behind the wheel of his SUV. But the mayor not revealing all today, she said out of deference to the chief's wife and his family. Here's ABC's Lindsay Davis. Tonight, Chicago's top cop, police superintendent Eddie Johnson, fired just weeks before he was set to retire. After reviewing an inspector general's report and video evidence, without being specific, the city's mayor says Johnson lied about an October incident when officers found him unconscious in his SUV. Johnson claimed he hadn't taken his blood pressure medication and had had a few drinks with dinner. He intentionally misled the people of Chicago, and he intentionally misled me. Johnson, who was largely popular in Chicago, gained national attention earlier this year during the Jussie Smollett case. Why would anyone, especially an African-American man, use the symbolism of a noose to make false accusations? Just last month, the mayor celebrated Johnson's more than 30-year career as a police officer. But today, an about face. The mayor saying he demonstrated a series of ethical lapses she called intolerable. This moment needs to be a turning point for the Chicago Police Department, the way things are done in this city. It is unclear at this time if Johnson will be entitled to his pension. The mayor declined to comment about specifics about the case in deference to Johnson's wife and children. However, the inspector general's report could ultimately be made public, David. All right, Lindsay Davis with us tonight. Thank you, Lindsay. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.